not for the two amigos. It is time for the three amigos. A little toast, Papa. A little toast. Huh? Oh, that's good. That's two amigos. Ha, ha, ha. You gonna open that or what? Folks, we are proudly introducing the patriarch of our family just off the boat last night, Papa Vino. Papa, 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 welcome, huh? <laughs> you know, take your time with that if you'd like. Jeez. You know, our knowledge of wine and grape growing really comes from this grand old man. As boys, we grew up working out in the grapevines with our cousins. So you picture this. We're stomping on grapes. We're picking grapes. We're doing all of that stuff. Not in this country, but somewhere else. <laughs> but we're having a good time. I remember one, you may got to remember this story. I remember one time, my brother and I out there were working with our cousins, and we are suckering grapevines. You know, it's, it's kind of a spring time, and you're popping off all the canes that you don't want that are not fruit-bearing. We're out there, we're working, we're popping this stuff and whatever. Cousins, the whole thing, Papa Vino's over there, he's standing there like the grand old man he is, the Don. <laughs> My brother comes up to me and he says, he says, hey, 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 I got a problem. I said, what's your problem? He says, I got to go potty. I say, you got to go potty? We just left the house. You can't go potty now. You go tell Papa Vino you got to go potty, he's going to beat your head with his cane. He says, I can't help it, I got to go potty. And I said, well, I'll tell you what, just go down around the corner of vines, nobody can see you, pull up your overcoat, sit down, squat, do your business, then come back. Nobody's going to know. He says, okay. So he flutters down there holding his little, <laughs> holding his little, his little overcoat up. Can't we go back to work? Where all of a sudden we're working, nobody really misses him because he doesn't work very hard anyway. <laughs> and all of a sudden we hear this yelping. Yep, yep, yep. And he comes running around the corner, his pants are down to his ankles, he's tripping, and he's fluttering his overcoat, it looks, his trench coat, it looks like he's a bird coming around the corner. Everybody stops what they're doing, he comes running up and he goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I said, what's wrong, what's wrong, what's wrong? He says, a snake bit my butt. <laughs> we almost died, I'll tell you. Papa Vino was upset with him, upset. Our cousins are all around. And I'll tell you, to this day, the cousins, we have a... We have a meeting, we have a Christmas, we have a birthday. Everybody comes together and they go, hey, did the snake still attach to your butt? <laughs> funny, 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 funny. <laughs> Papa okay? Oh, God, he was asleep. A <laughs> little more wine, a little more wine. 